So this is on a, a Toyota 4.0 liter. So this will cover Toyota Tacoma from 2005 to 2015, Toyota 4Runners from 2003 to 2009, Toyota FJ Cruisers from 2007 to 2009, and your Toyota Tundras from 2005 to 2011. All use this 4.0 liter V6 engine. Right on the uh, passenger side, if you're looking at the, if you're staying at the front of the car, it's on the left-hand side. There is a little square cover, and the square cover hold, or covers the uh, timing chain tensioner. And there is a gasket behind there, and that gasket actually wears out over time. So there's four, it's either 12 or 14 millimeter bolts that hold this cover on. It's tiny, it's like two inches by three inches, or two inches by two and a half inches. I'll put a picture of the cover by itself up right now, and you guys can see what I'm talking about. But uh, there's just four bolts that hold this thing on. If you take it off, don't worry, nothing's gonna pop out. The uh, time, uh, the timing chain tensioner is not gonna roll out or fall out or anything. But why I'm changing this is there's oil all over the cover. You can see it right here as I flip this thing over. Um, there's the gasket. But yeah, it's covered in oil. And I was doing the water pump on this and the oil had actually gotten onto the left side of the water pump as well. So there I cleaned it up real quick with some parts, uh, brake parts cleaner. And then um, once I cover, or once I clean the cover, I'm gonna go hit the, um, the engine block where the cover goes to. And you're gonna wanna get that as clean as you can, clean as a whistle. You don't want any oil or debris or any uh, grime or muck or mick down there. You just wanna make sure that's nice and clean. So. Um, just taking the brake cleaner, getting the rag, cleaning all that up, getting all the dirt and debris off. Uh, if you're worried about um, dirt or debris getting into the engine right there, because obviously you have a straight shot into the engine, you can always do an oil change after this as well to uh, get ready in, to get rid of any of that dirt and grime that actually gets in there. But uh, what I used to seal this up, now I could have gone and gotten another gasket from Toyota, but uh, what I wanted to do is use Toyota Seal Pack 103. It's a, it's a FIPG, which stands for Form in Place Gasket. I'll put a link in the description below. But this Form in Place Gasket, uh, the Toyota Seal Pack, is probably the best stuff I have found out there in my last 20 years of working on cars. Actually, longer than that. So what it what it does, it actually stays. Um, I don't know. So if you, if you ever used RTV, RTV after a while gets hard and, and brittle. But the FPIG, FIPG, actually stays pretty pliable. Um, I've used it on oil pans. I've used it on valve cover gaskets. I'm obviously using it on this cover right here. But you just go around, you place a bead of um, Toyota seal pack onto it. And then I put the four bolts back in and then line it up onto the uh, engine cover. Or the I should say the... Uh, timing chain cover. I should have, I could have taken the old gasket off. I didn't. Uh, I don't know if it really matters or not. I cleaned that up with brake cleaner as well. But uh, if you wanted, you could take it to a wire wheel and get that old gasket off, um, the paper gasket, and uh, do it that way. But uh, just line everything up, get the four bolts in place. There's nothing special. I sure there is a torque spec out there for it but i just uh, got a quarter inch ratchet and tighten it up that way in kind of a star sequence you'll see me here in a second um, put it all back together so i'm running them down with the uh with the socket and then i just kind of go in a crisscross pattern you know top left bottom right bottom left top right and then i'll run it down here with my quarter inch uh ratchet just needs to be snug you don't have to be superman when you do this and um it's been what a thousand miles since this has happened and there's no more oil leak one thing i did do is i let it sit for 24 hours before running the engine so that the uh, toyota seal pack had a uh, time to uh, actually cure and um to form into place and then i put the date or the month and the year of actually when i did this so hope this helps you out guys